enjoy today have not come without a price. Lying here in the cemeteries across the nation are men and women who gave their lives so that we can be free, live in freedom and without fear. We thank those who gave their lives to keep us free and shall not forget you. We shall always remember. On behalf of all the organizers, the volunteers, the guests, and our participants, I would especially like to thank all those who have served or are still serving. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. One of our most respected veterans and a member of the American Legion, uh, post everlasting, our 41st president, George H.W. Bush said, in critical things, unity. In important things, diversity. In all things, generosity. Today we show a united front of gratitude and respect across the United States of America as we remember the fallen, honor those who serve, and teach our children the value of freedom. Quoting our 40th president, Ronald Reagan, freedom is never more than one generation away from extinction. We don't pass it to our children through our bloodline, our, our bloodstream. It must be fought for, protected, and handed on for them to do the same. Or one day we will spend our sunset years till, telling our children and our children's children what it was once like in the United States to be a free man. We have many young people here today who have volunteered their time and energy to honor and respect our fallen veterans is very much appreciated. We'd like to thank you for being here, for respecting those who fought for our freedoms, and learning the lessons of history. In the midst of remembering the past, we can also celebrate our future with our presence here today. If you'd all rise, we will spend a few moments in silence respecting our fallen. Commander of VFW Post 9182 will lay a remembrance wreath in memory of those who served or are serving in the United States Army. the land remembrance wreath in memory of those who serve or are serving in the United States Navy.
history and memory of those who served or are serving in the United States Air Force. Kano will lay a wreath in remembrance of the memory of those who served or are serving in the United States Merchant Marines. Hood Sparks will lay remembrance wreath in honor of the United States service men and women from all branches of the service whose last known status was either prisoner of war or missing in action. These individuals <clears throat> have never returned to their families and homes and we will not forget you.